Hello everybody, and thanks for joining me. I wanted to do a video series on many option strategies which will include stock and or option risk graphs, and then how to create and interpret those risk graphs. So I'm using Thinkorswim here. This is a nice little program for uh, doing this kind of work. Uh, all real-time data, which is amazing. Um, so let's just start with stock. And each of these videos is going to build on each other, so uh, I'm going to keep these short uh, so they're not so painful to get through. <laughs> I know what it's like to try to digest a lot of material. Uh, so let's take stock first. Uh, if I hover over the bid or ask side, right, the bid side is the most anybody's willing to pay for that stock, right, and the ask side is the least anybody's willing to sell it. So if I'm going to buy a stock, I can buy it right now from this inside seller. So I click on that, it drops in uh, a default of 100 shares. I could uh, easily change that to a sell, which you'll see in one second. So click on buy. 100 shares, it's irrelevant at this point, at the uh, stock price of 35.88. And this could be any stock, I'm just using this as an example. So now I can come over here to the risk profile. All right, And you can see now what a risk profile of a straight bot stock looks like. All right, so on the bottom, you've got the price of the underlying asset going from zero all the way up to infinity. If you wanted to scrunch that up, you can left click and drag this over. Um, we could push it all the way out, right? You can uh, drag it back out. You can also slide this whole risk graph left to right. See how the prices on the bottom are just changing in time frame now. On the y axis, we've got a zero for uh, break even, and then we've got money increasing in our account and money decreasing in our account. So in this scenario, if we buy this stock at 35.88, buy 100 shares of it, we already know that our max loss, if the stock goes to zero, would be $3,588. But our max gain is limitless. The stock could go up forever, all right? which would be nice if we were long, of course. <laughs> but uh, that's the first idea. And that's how you're gonna, we're going to take apart a risk graph of any entity. Just keeping it simple here with a bot stock first. All right, so what happens if you sell a stock short? Yeah, there you go. Now what we've done is we've just switched that around. And look what happens to our risk graph. If I sell a stock short at 34.20, all right, then if the stock goes down, I'm going to make money. But look what I can make. So that $3,420 would be mine to keep. Uh, but look what happens if it goes up. If it gaps up even, I would be hurt worse and worse. And the stock could go up forever, and I could lose infinite amounts of money. All right, so people will always want to protect themselves, whether they're long or short. So there's a long one, and I would want to put a protective stop in. I'll keep it simple and do a stop at one point away. So if I buy it at 35.88 and I put a stop at 34.88, there's one point. One point times the 100 shares. I'm going to lose at most $100 unless I get gapped on. And that's why people uh, will oftentimes hedge themselves. And we'll talk about some hedging strategies later. Same thing with selling short. If I sell short 100 shares at 34.20, I'm going to put a protective stop one point away, just as an example. You'd always have to go look at a price pattern to make sure that you're picking the most relevant place for overhead resistance, and then putting a protective stop uh, above that. And make sure it's relevant for your risk profile as well. But uh, a protective stop, just to keep it simple, at 3520, I would be risking $100. So 100 shares short at one point, $100 of risk, unless the stock gaps up. Like I said before, you could uh, be potentially in this for unlimited risk. Again, hedging myself would make me sleep better at night. <laughs> and uh, we're going to talk about some of those strategies. So very nice to take apart a risk graph and understand what the x and y axis of these are. This is going to be very, very helpful later on as we take apart more and more complex uh, either straight option strategies or stock option combos. All right, thanks for joining me. And if you want to see more instructional videos like this or even live walkthroughs of actual trades, uh, go to www.freetradingvideos.com.